Right, the first thing you have to do is we have to get the fat in there and get it in the oven because we want it seriously hot. That is the secret to a good Yorkshire pudding and a rise. So, start getting the fat in. What you can normally use is just um, any oil really, vegetable oil works best, but since it's Christmas, I'm going to use the old duck fat. So I'm just going to put, so we'll get them in the oven and we'll get it hot. It's going to be in there for at least 15 to 20 minutes. As you can see, I do this method and it works out spot on every time. I do a, a three, a three and a one. So we're just filling a, just a normal sized um, coffee mug with uh, milk, three eggs and three tablespoons of all purpose flour. So we'll start off and we'll put our eggs into the bowl. We're going to put our milk in there. Give that a quick whisk. Not too much. Now, we're going to put in three tablespoons of flour. That's one. That's two. And there's three. So at this stage, I'm just going to pour half a teaspoon of salt. Yes, you can buy it in a packet and just add eggs or add milk. But I always find there's something special about making it yourself because it's that anticipation whether it's going to rise or not. And nobody likes flat pack shorts you put in. Right, that's all incorporated. So what we're going to do is just going to put it in the fridge just to settle down till the, um, till the fat has uh, got to its temperature. Beautiful, perfect. Mmm, them. With a bit of gravy on them, soaked in. 
out of medium rare roast beef. The sky's the limit. But there it is, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Mmm, it's all good.